so I'm Ashley, this is Jake. We're here at Presidio Sport and Medicine in San Francisco. Uh, one of the things I use this shuttle balance for is a quad strengthening series we call the VMO circuit. So first thing that he's gonna do is come up, step up on here. He's gonna put his hand or his feet in between the four and the eight oh, like okay, he has sure. it. And then I'm just gonna have him drop down and just hold a squat. And he'll do that, just holding that there for as long as I tell him. So that's part one of the VMO circuit. Part two, I'd have him stand up, I'd have him bring his legs a little bit wider, point the toes out slightly, he's gonna come down into the linebacker and then he's just gonna pulse up and down, nice and small. Very nice, so that would be our second one. And then for the third one, I'll have him step off. Creates a nice steep incline for him to go ahead and step up on there. And hold that ski tuck position, leaning forward into his toes. And then he has to kind of pulse side to side. Uh huh. Okay, that's good <laughs> before he breaks himself. Very nice. To make it easier, what we would do is just take the chains here and move them out to create a little bit better base of support. And then we can do a single leg squat coming, stepping onto it. So he'd put one leg there and then he would step up and then back down. Sit down, just like that. And come up and down to finish out the series. Get into that inner quad. Okay, good, I'm glad you liked it. <laughs> We do a lot of balancing exercises on here, especially for people who are kind of te working with uh, new joints and things like that. We can do lunges, stepping onto the, up onto the platform and then stepping off to kind of create those, that balance. Um, and then we also do a lot of tandem standing and it's sideways so it wiggles from side to side and throw a ball toss. We can do some like Statues of Liberty. You can really get really creative with this thing. You could have it up here, you would keep it flat, and then he would stand on one leg on there, drop it down, and then pick it right back up. Mm -hmm. He'd come down and across, and then he'd come all the way up to standing. Mm -hmm. This is tough. Yeah, this is, a tough, this is definitely one of the more advanced settings, for sure. Well, yeah, especially our older patients who we have them doing a little bit more dynamic things in here. They like that the bars are so close so that they can either lean into it or hold onto it. They're right there. It makes them more comfortable while doing possibly a scarier exercise. 